I'm Yannis Shangyuar, and in this tutorial, let's make another one. This time, cluster bombs. Yannis Shangyuar here, and let's uh, let's make some cluster bombs, shall we? Um, this is just a general idea of a cluster. So think of it like a, as a two-stage type of missile. So like you shoot your missile, boom, and another thing payload comes out. This could be you know anything. As you saw, I had some uh, nice good bombs there. Um, you can find, I, I'll add some of this uh, information at the bottom in, um, in the description. Um, please join the Discord if you would like some more codes like this. Um, I have a lot of instructions over here. Um, so yeah, anyway, let's get right into this. So basically, we're going to just copy and paste this code that I've already created. Um, this code will start with the effects list. So this we will pop in there. Essentially this is creating the explosion. So like as you saw the Tomahawk missile blew up and then more bombs came out of it. So that explosion is this effect right here. And then we're going to go to the object creation list and add the object creation list cluster which you know we're going to create down here because we're, we need to create the cluster object to be exact. That's what we will make in a second. Um, and then we will go to the weapon I and I and add the this weapon right here. Um, this is essentially for the Tomahawk um, unit. Um, or if you want to modify it, you can put it on your Tomahawk launcher, um, as I have as a super weapon, or you can adapt it and make it a scun missile if you want. Um, it doesn't really matter because at the end of the day, as you saw up there, as you're about to see below, um, you're going to see I'm going to need to uh, create and edit this object right here. Notice the dash when I'm about to go down. Um, also, I'll add the uh, death code right here. So we're going to throw around into the weapon object, you know, copy and paste, blah, blah, blah. As I said, remember the dash. That's what that object is up there about. So essentially, this is the missile. Um, all right, future Janice here coming in with the correction real fast. Uh, not so much a correction, but more of an overlook thing. So if you notice in that last cut, the locomotor is set to Tomahawk Missile locomotor 1. Um, that's because its airborne height is set to 100 and as you saw that is when it will explode is at height 100 so don't forget to add in that locomotor to be that height or whatever height you set it to. You can even set it to 30 whatever. Cool. Oh also uh, in the object creation list uh, input if the count obvious you know, you can control the number. Cool. Earlier I told you about the uh, OCL uh, cluster. That's is where you would be inserting that, but you'd be copy and paste it anyway. This is just an exemplar. The c again, the code would be in the description. So the way that this works is the m missile object, so the weapon object, which is in this case would be a Tomahawk missile, has a an ability to, it launches itself and fires off, so you would put this on the object, um, and then when it gets to a certain point, so this is this would be the object, when it gets to a certain height, which in this case would be up to four seconds to the height 100, to which case it will explode with the cluster, and the cluster is, and the cluster object in this case is the mother of all bombs model, which is the death weapon that I told you to go up there and copy. In this case, it's 50 points of damage of an explosion. And then you can just modify it from there and play with other ways you want to do it. And uh, stick around and let's experiment with this and take it a step further. Live on air, the Jaguar is back. So I am going to make an experiment live in this recording. Let's test it out. So we are going to... Um, create my V3 um, unit from Red Alert 2 that I imported in into this and going to follow my instructions. Um, so we that's already in there, we don't have to worry about that. And so we will need to create a V3 cluster.
Seth will be the bomb. Which will turn into this weapon. Let's give it a shot. the angle right but it got the general idea down success all right so maybe we should add a little extra effect now perhaps the neutron effect Fantastic. That's all she wrote.